Made in Hollywood. Very few voice actors are overnight discoveries. Most have been studying, training, and performing for years. Larry Sabella attended the University of Miami. Mr. Sabella began his career on Broadway, has made over 100 television appearances, and continues to be the voice of Pumbaa in the Disney Parks movie sequels and spin-off series. Hi, it's Ernie Sabella, and you're watching Made in Hollywood, and here's a scene from my favorite movie, The Lion King. Repeat after me. <coughs> Hakuna Matata. What? Hakuna Matata. It means no worries. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Hakuna Matata. Ain't no passing craze. I was doing Guys and Dolls on Broadway at night, and uh, Nathan Lane and I got a call to go over to the audition. And when we got there, they asked us to read uh, the hyenas. And we walked in, and we were reading the hyena lines and ad-libbing and just having a, a bunch of fun. And we did a couple of sessions, and I thought, well, they like what we're doing, but they're going to bring in a big star, and, and so let's not get used to this cushy job. <laughs> Hakuna Matata? Yeah, it's our motto. What's the motto? Nothing. What's the motto with you? <laughs> you know, kid, these two words will solve all your problems. That's right. I borrowed a little bit from uh, an actor called uh, Michael Gazzo from The Godfather, another great, great movie, who, uh, during the courtroom scene, leaned back and said things like, Well, Mr. Corleone says do this, Mr. Corleone says do that. Just do what he says, you know? <laughs> so my first line being, Oh, he's so cute and all alone. Can we keep him? And they laughed, and I thought, well, we'll go that direction. <laughs> when he was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog. Very nice. Thanks. I went to the University of Miami, uh, where you had to have a pulse to get in. And luckily, I had a pulse, so I got in. And I lucked out because the theater department was run by a couple of guys from New York, from the actor's studio. And I just found where I had to live. And then I went to the University of London for a summer and studied there and came back. And my first Broadway show was a workshop. And I did a couple of Broadway shows. And then somebody said, oh, you know, go out and do some television. So. Mustered up, got on the plane, and went to all the calls we could muster and started working pretty quickly. And I, I never said no to anything. I mean, they wanted me to play one day, fine. Uh, one month, fine. Big part, small part. I, I, work begets work. And uh, when you're on the set, you meet people, and that, that is more information on how to get the next job. And oh, the shame! What a change in my name! Oh, what's in a name? And I got down How did you feel? Every time that I... Hey, Pumper, not in front of the kids. Oh, sorry. I like to brush up. Not so much in the last, like, 20 years, but for the first 20 years, I sit in on Actors Studio sessions, uh, Stella Adler sessions, Austin Pendleton sessions, and... Uh, Friends of mine who were going to like a, a Shakespeare class, I'd sit in on that. And if you say to yourself, should I be an actor, then you shouldn't. You have to say to yourself, I am an actor. I must be an actor. Nothing will stop me. Then you're an actor. Yup, yup. Oh, some bacon. Yup, yup, yup. He's a big pig. Yup, yup. You can be a big pig too. Hey. 